Hello, all of you beautiful humans. Welcome, 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 welcome to Menopause and Madness. I am April Rain, your host, and welcome to my midlife crisis. Oh, the end of the week is here. How are we all feeling? Do we have some great plans for the weekend? Um, my days, my last couple of days have been, um, I've been dealing with some things, you know, internal things. And, um, but I think I'm, I'm going to be getting through it just fine. Um, I would like to take a little breath first so that we can get in our little bubble. So we inhale. Hold it. Exhale. That's nice, isn't it? Shake a shake a shake a shake a all of that outside ugliness and and horrible evil that's going on outside world. And let's be in our little bubble where it's just you and me. Okay, how are we feeling? How are we feeling? How are we doing? What are y'all going to be doing for this weekend? Yes, April's asking a lot of questions, isn't she? <laughs> um, I do have a Timu haul for you today. I did want to do a, I have a few, a few uh, themed, team, themed Timu hauls that are going to be coming up. And I am so excited. And I have most of everything I need for uh, these hauls, except for just like a few things. And they're in different packages, not different orders, different packages. But I have received a few little packages and don't let the, don't let the smallness fool you. No, no. There are quite a few things in uh, one of those bags and it is actually my most everything i think i'm pretty sure it is everything for my um crafting junk journaling that i'm gonna start doing um with Gigi's attic and crafts i'm sorry girl you know that that is like i don't know it is so weird coming out of my mouth i mean it's beautiful but you know i just i don't know what it is i think i'm just blah, 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 you know whatever but Gigi's attic and crafts I don't know why I get, I always think of basement for some reason. I'm like, I don't know why. Um, but she will be starting a series sometime soon. I'm patient. I'm patient, girl. You know me. I love you. And I am not trying to pressure, pressure, but I am very excited. And I, um, I've never done, I've done journaling my whole life. And it's just basically you have your book, you know, and you write now. From what I take, junk journaling is getting all the, it's like, a, it's like a, a combination of scrapbooking and journaling. And I love that. I never really got too far into scrapbooking. I did make one. I did make one. And unfortunately, I no longer have it, but I was pretty proud of it. It was pretty cute. It was, it was fun. It was fun. But I, um, I take the, you know, now I wish that I had had some things from like my grandparents and my mother. I have, I have nothing. Uh, the only picture of my mother that I have is her driver's license. And that goes to a lot of, you know, uh, family drama. Oh, my curls wanted to do whatever they wanted to do. It fell and I thought it was cute. So here we are. Um, I'm also wearing my Blossom Funky, I love these earrings, they're Timu, they're Timu, and of course my turtleneck, my, my, one of my turtlenecks, and um, I'm wearing the shirt, I love this shirt, not just because it is, I can't remember if it was this one or the burgundy one, but I think this one is 95% cotton and 5% spandex. And then the burgundy shirt that I think I wore in my last video is, um, I'm, I think I'm getting this confused. Or maybe it was also 95%, but 95% cotton is like the most that I have seen in these t-shirts. They feel wonderful. 
But if you caught Erin at Hey Everybody, she actually hauled a 100% cotton t-shirt. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Thank you, Timu, for that. Uh, but this is the shirt that says crazy. Uh, I prefer the term hilariously. I have my camera zoomed in. I'm trying all this lighting, but it says I prefer the term hilariously unstable. Yeah, I like that. Um, I am. I've got a light over this way. There is some actual um, outside lighting, outside lighting, some, you know, daylight. And I've got my ring on low. So I'm trying to kind of figure this lighting thing out. So that way I'm not blinding you when I wear my glasses and, you know, but for right now, my ring light does have to stay in front of me. Honestly, I don't think most of you care, but, um, you know, I do want it to be the best it can be and it will get there. I will get there. Yes. Yes. So, okay. So I get, yeah, uh, oops, I'm sorry. That was me. Um, the, the, back to the junk journaling. I kind of feel bad calling it junk journaling because it's not really junk. I mean, if you have seen Gigi's from Gigi from Gigi's Attic and Crafts, she has shown some beautiful work that she's done, some beautiful junk journals, and I think they are just amazing. She is so good at it. She is just very good at it and what she does is beautiful i want all the different types of like antique laces and i mean just all different kinds of really cool things you know that are actually old and i think that is really cool too if i if i there was my grandma had so much lace and things like that and um i wish i had them so that i can put the, them in this junk journal and the purpose of this journal that I am going to be making is so that I can write in it. You know, I want to spend like a year or however long writing in it. And then I want to leave it to my daughter. So I want to be able to put things in it that I know she will love that have meant something to us like in the past, because as a lot of you might know, um, I am estranged from my children and um, that's another video and, and continued video. Okay. Um, but that's the purpose of the, the journal that I'm going to be making is so that I can leave it to her. So she will be able to, you know, read that. And, you know, I always, because me and my mother, we, we only spent the last three years actually bonding, connecting. She had apologized for a, a lot of things that happened in our past. And, those three years were the three years that I was taking care of her, um, her and my grandfather until they both passed. And um, that meant everything to me. It really did. It meant every, everything to me. And I wish that I had asked so much more, so many more questions. I wish I asked my parent, my grandparents more questions. I really, really do. Um, so if you still have, you know, your parents and your grandparents, ask them things, ask them about their lives, ask them, ask them things, you know, learn from them, but, you know, learn about yourself from them, you know, and that's something I really wished I would have done, but, um, this is the purpose of the journal. So that way, you know, I can answer these questions. I can, you know, send her to, I can guide her through things. You know, my daughter is 31 years old now, so, you know, she's not, a young girl, you know, younger girl. Um, but I want her to be able to, because there's a lot of questions and a lot of um, pain that I have from my mother. And I don't want her to suffer with that. I mean, we're suffering enough right now through these years that we are being estranged and, and that, and I don't want her to suffer when I'm gone. So, okay, enough with all the chitty chat, chitty chat, whatever, whatever that is, right? And let's get started. I do also have a few items that came in this, this little pouch. There's not very much in here, but they're actually beauty products and I need them. 
So um, they're not part of like a themed haul or anything right now. So I want to get those out of the way. So this might be a little bit of a longer video. So please grab yourself something to sip on, whatever is your poison, y'all know. And uh, let's hang out. Let's hang out and look at some really cool stuff. Hydrate. Hydrate. Okay. So one of the first things I want to look at that I thought was cool, and this I had to take out of the bag because it's big and flat and I didn't want it getting ruined. This was $2.54, and as of when I priced this, it was still $2.54. And I saw this, um, I saw Amy on Hauler Time haul this. She does so many um, like junk journaling, crafting, all that kind of stuff. She does a lot of that and it to me it's very interesting because i see stuff i never seen before and like this which this is they call it cicada paper and at first i was like and i still don't know i mean i don't know is it made out of cicadas but it is when i look at it now i'm going to open it i hope i can get it folded back up the way they have it seeing it in the pictures on the website it's just really cool. And I love how it looks antique. It feels, it feels funky. So let me just take one piece. Oh, wow. It's super thin. You can see it's super thin. You can see my lights back there. So I'm not going to take it all apart. It's, it's, it's soft. It's a soft paper. And I wanted this, if you see the color, see how it's, the look of it. I love that look because it's got like the antique type look, you know, and I love that. And I think now that I'm feeling it, that there are so many different things you could do. It is so thin. It is so thin. I can see, I can see my, my phone camera through here, but I'm, I've already got my, my mind is just going nuts, you know, with like scrunching it up, maybe putting some mod podge on it to kind of have that certain textured look that's what i'm thinking about so i was pretty happy to get these i was actually really stoked they are again 254 and it's supposed to be only two sheets i believe or 20 sheets let me check real quick let me put my eyes on okay these curls keep just doing whatever they want to do. Okay, well, there's... It's cross-wing leather paper. But in the description, it said cicada wing paper. So I was like, is it made out of cicada wings? I mean, I don't know. So if you know, let me know. But it is, it is quite a bit. It is actually quite a bit. There is a lot here. I mean, there is a lot. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. See, that's the texture I was thinking about that I'd like. And I just thought, yeah, you know, that's really cool. I've never worked with it before. So if you all have any tips, or tricks, you know how I feel about the tips and the tricks. Let me know what you think about it. Let me know how you like working with it if you do. I know there are quite a few crafters out there. Um, that might know about, about doing this. So that is very cool. Okay, now this next thing, I was very excited. Now it was 1029 and it is actually now 720. And yes, I, of course, I get my, my price adjustments 100%. Oh, I wear my little kitty ring. Now this is a ring I got from Timu a while back and, and it's very pretty. Look at how it does sit up pretty, very high. But look at that sparkle. Isn't that beautiful? I love that sparkle. And of course, my favorite right now ring. 
This is another Timu ring that is a favorite, and it is the uh, one that was like, to me, it reminds me of a Japanese cherry blossom tree. In the description, they did say tree of life. And see, I'm still doing that. I'm sorry about that. So I'll try to keep my glasses from hitting that ring light. Okay, now this is the next item items. Now, I thought this was a super great deal. And what it is, is it's like a, a kit. It's like a, it, it's not like, it is a, um, like junk journaling kit. And it has all kinds of things. And please forgive me if I don't know what certain things are called. As I have said, I am very new to this, so I am just learning. And um, if you are interested in the doing the junk journaling, I do know that Gigi will have, Gigi from Gigi's Attic and Crafts will have a series. And she's going to start from the very beginning. And I think we're all just going to be kind of, you know, following along with her. But this has inside, oh, I feel so special. Okay, first it has a book and this is the, the cover for it. It is just a cover so you can make your own book. And that is really cool. And that, that kind of helps me, you know, it gives me an idea. I have watched, as I said, Amy with Holler Time who has done quite a few things and she'll she shows you like putting stuff together a little bit, you know, this is the back of it. Oh, I love the smell of new books. And it is just, it, it's a notebook, but it has the graph inside. So I don't know if there is like a purpose for that. There is a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of pages. And if I had access, right now which i do but i didn't bring it over i could have brought my laptop over and i could read you the description for and you know i guess that is something that should have been important that i should have added but it is quite a thick it's quite thick it's quite thick now this could be something that you could practice um which is what i was thinking was that i could like do outlines of what I would like to do with my um, journal that I will be making. And uh, so that was my thoughts with this book. And you get this book. You also get all kinds. You just get all kinds of really cool things. I'm not going to show you every piece because y'all know how I feel about that. There's like, I think it's like 200 pieces in here. So we'd be here forever. Um, but there's so many cool things like these little hearts that actually ha you can punch them out, punch them out <laughs> and you can, you know, do all kinds of things like that. There's these picture frames and you can also punch the middle part out. So there is like a, Oh, I can't think of what those are called right now where you, they're like dotted. So you can punch out the, the paper, please forgive me. Um, and it looks like just maybe, Oh, it's all about the reflexes. Okay. Yeah. And stickers. So these do have stickers and I thought, look at that. That is just awesome. I love that picture. That picture right there is so cool to me. Yeah, see, I don't know about this lighting. So there is, here you have one of Napoli. So it's just, it, it's very cool. They're like travel. I love the uh, medieval type look of this, which I do believe is the one that I chose. Okay, now here it looks like you just have so much. You have so much. This is really a great deal. Okay, these look like stickers. I'm not sure if they are, but they have, they're very thin. Like I can see they're very, very thin. And they look like maybe 
they don't look like stickers, but they look like, you know, I do have something for things that aren't stickers that will be coming up. And they just look really antiqued and very cool. And I will keep you all updated also, uh, periodically, once I do start the uh, journaling series and show you, you know, updates of what I'm doing with all of this beautiful stuff. Now, this is washi tape. And I think a lot of you already know what washi tape is. Now, this is, this is awesome. And I don't know much about it. I just know you can, you can use it. I mean, there's so many different ways that you can use all of this stuff. It's all depending on your own creat creativity, you know. So I'd like to know why it's called washi tape. I thought that was pretty interesting. Um, here we have sticky notes and they are bundled like this. The packaging of this is just gorgeous. And these are just more, they are lined and they are so pretty. They're just so pretty and delicate looking. I, I love this. And these are the type of things that I could, you know, that will be stuck on that I will have little either quotes or little messages for my Alexis. That's her name, Alexis. Alexis Renee. And she no longer has my last name. She has she has her wife's last name. Oh, and here's some paper, just some just some little papers that you can stick in there also. I am so excited to do this. I really am. This just looks like a really fun type of thing to do and I'm excited about what I'm going to be doing with it also so I've seen I have seen like uh Gigi has um you're gonna be hearing a lot about Gigi in this right so um if you haven't checked her out go check her out because she's really cool she's just a beautiful human and she's really funny and she's a friend of mine and I love her to death she is great um now we have like what looks like could be like ticket stubs it says music and then you got lemon and i'm not sure if that's exactly what they are but they have all different kinds i mean it's just this stuff is really wherever your imagination takes you now here is an envelope and i just recently learned what you do with these and I'm trying to think who it was. I'm so sorry that I can't remember. But it wasn't Gigi. There was another YouTuber I was watching where I learned about. Oh, it was um, Ashley from Ashton's Beauty. She had shown her junk journal that she had done. And that's where I learned about how you use the envelopes. And hers was really awesome too. Hers was really awesome. If you haven't checked out Ashton's Beauty, she's another friend of mine. She's really sweet. She has, she does Timu, all different kinds of things. So here's another envelope, but I thought that was cool. How the envelopes, so you're, you, you know, you're going through and I, I, you know, imagine my daughter going through this and there's an envelope and she'll pull out a little whatever's in there and it's a card and it's like, I also have one more, I have a few more things coming for junk journaling, but they're not going to be here for a minute. And they're actually little wooden buttons and they're for like sewing buttons. And I got them because I want to use them because they're really kind of um, retro, you know, really old school looking. And so I just thought it would be cool. You know, you put a little note in here. It's like a little surprise, you know, so I'm, I'm imagining my daughter seeing that and loving that. And here there is just, you've got lots more papers, pages, however you want to do it. And they're just really great. Is that upside down? I mean, I love that. I love that look. I love that aesthetic and I can't wait to do this. So here we have, oh my gosh, here we have some awesome clings or stickers. I'm not sure. They don't feel like stickers. But you can, there are the, oh, I can't think of that word, so that you can, you know, push them out. And those are beautiful. 
these are all just really cool very cool i don't understand and you like have a whole package of them you have all kinds of them and the selection you also when you go to purchase one of these kits that was on this with this kit there was like four different kits so you have four different options of different kinds of aesthetics um genres that kind of thing here there are more like you uh, cut the you cut them out oh that is cool and i just love that i love how it's just oh, oh that's pretty that's really pretty really pretty I'm just about done with this kit. Look at the pretty, look at the pretty flowers. I love the pretty flowers. And then at the bottom of the kit, you have some larger pages. And I believe there are only five in here, but there's all different, all different types of, well, there you go. Coffee, cappuccino, yum. Oh no oh no okay so i am just loving this and for what i say it was like seven and change it is so worth the price so worth the price i don't know how um quality what the quality is supposed to be like with this but with every single thing they have packaged separately and this book I mean, this is awesome. If you just wanted to use this as, you know, however you want to use it, this is going to be like a practice um, book where I can actually see how something will look before I put it in the, the, my journal. And I'm super stoked about it. I am super, super stoked about it. So if you are interested, okay, come on, come on, you littles. If you are interested in these kids, this one, like I said, was seven twenty. I mean, that's just that's awesome. That is one thing I do have to say about Timu's crafting supplies. They have the best my earring, everything, everything. They have the best prices for crafting supplies, all different kinds of crafting supplies. So next I have, now I've been wanting these. I got these for 91 cents. It was on a flash sale. They're now $1.78. And what they are, oh, I'm so happy to have these. You know, I purchase stickers from Timu because they have amazing selections of stickers. And I use them on my my when i send packages and i've just been keeping them in um in an organizer but just in the plastic that they come in so it's really kind of a pain when i want to when i'm packaging you know um, orders or prizes giveaways whatever i am having to go through each one so i got these containers so i can mix them up put them in here these are perfect these are just what I needed. So I'm super stoked to have these. And I, for 91 cents, you know, two of them came for 91 cents. And anytime that these type of containers go on a flash sale, I got to pick at least one up. So I'm super stoked really to have these so that my stickers, I can just kind of slide them around and pick out the ones that I'm going to want to, to use. And I love that. Okay, this next uh, item was four seventy eight, and it looks like it's still four seventy eight. And I am super excited about this. Four seventy eight is an amazing price, and they are wooden, the wooden rubber stamps. And you have the alphabet in this type of font. I don't remember what it's called, and then you have your numbers. And I'm not sure what, I don't know if that's an ink pad that comes with it, but we're about to find out. 
So what are, what, you know, what do you guys have planned for this weekend? You guys have big plans or are you just going to stay home and chill and maybe do chores, hang out with your families, you know? Lonnie and I, we are actually going to go over to one of, to our good friends. Um, we have a couple of friends. Hi, Laura and Rob. And um, we do game night. We've been doing it for years. And, you know, it, it's slowed recently because, you know, life and everything that goes on. But usually we try to do it twice a month. And uh, it's pretty fun. We play all different kinds of games. We mostly play this one game we really like. I do believe this is your ink pad. And it is wrapped. It's packaged very well. Very well. get it un unpackaged okay please don't make okay and there you go so you have it comes i didn't even realize that i thought it was just the stamps i didn't know it came with the with the ink pad so that's pretty cool that's very cool and these are just the cutest little stamps ever here you have a like i can't see it so i can't see if you can see it and then your stamp how cool and cute is that i i just think it's the cutest thing and for under five dollars the whole alphabet and the numbers i just think that's awesome so i am really really happy with this they are wooden and they they are they are nice nice they're nice these are very nice i like these i'm so happy that i was able to get these because i had tried to get um the antiqued looking ones and they keep they sell out they sell out and these were selling out and i was like no no i'm getting you <sighs> so april got it and i'm very stoked about that so that's going to be fun using those very fun okay now i did open these because i had been using these but these are stickers that say handmade with love and again it's for you know for you know orders and things like that oh yes finally i have been waiting for this because you know I'm not this, this claw, kitty claw. I love her, but when you push her up, she doesn't retract. And that kind of freaks me out. So for a dollar seven, and when I priced this, these were, a, this was a dollar five. I got myself a cloud because I love, and it's just a white one. Just a boring little white one, but it's cute and I love it. And it retracts on its own. And there is a grippy grippy. Oh, you can push it down so that it stays up. But then it, if you don't do the pushing, when you get it to the top, a lot of you probably already know this because most of you already have these, but I really needed that. So I'm super happy to have that. Um, let's see. Okay, I did get, and this was when you needed to buy two. I have seen, have you all seen how they give you the option now to buy two? I love that because I don't like being forced to do something that, you know, I don't want to do or I don't need two of. So I've seen that they, now it says, would you like to, and you can hit that and get two, but I wouldn't like to of, you know, certain things, but for a dollar 28 and it was for dollar 28 and they're now a dollar 15, I purchased, this is the double sided tape. I'm not going to take it out because I think a lot of you already know, you know, what double sided tape is, but I needed some of this. I've never worked with this. I've never used this before. So this is going to be an experience. And again, 
if you all got tips on on ways to use it things to use it on or how to use it i'm all ears y'all all ears okay now as i was saying this was 53 cents i don't know why i didn't get more of these but this is the double-sided tape in the little container like thing like i don't i've never used this either never used this before so i think i get it you know with a lot of especially the little things that um that are in that kit and that i would be using this would be really convenient and for 53 cents i couldn't pass it up no no okay okay so for a dollar 88 and the last time that i when when i price these they were dollar 87 and they are at just five rolls of washi tape and they're very pretty you know i like them they you you can choose from several different kind colors um but they do come all together and there are five of them and i think i think because i don't know is is this the only way that washi tape comes i mean like, are they all small rolls like this? Which isn't a problem. It's not a problem. I just, I don't have anything to compare it to. So I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Now this was 78 cents and I needed this because I can't even remember if I hauled it. Let me see. Okay. I didn't. I have it right here. And this is a wax seal. This is the seal. And if you can see there's a moon and stars above a mountain and i love that because it makes me think of our mount rainier i mount rainier is so majestic and beautiful and i just i love her i mean you know being born and raised around her is she just i just don't want her to get upset and blow her top you know what i'm saying because we are literally about 45 minutes away from the summit well, the summit that they call paradise, which is the highest that you can go without hiking. The rest of the way you need to hike. And that, as I said, was 78 cents, which I feel is a great deal because for 69 cents. Oh, please. I'll use my new cute little clown. Oh, I like that. I like that so much more. I'm sorry, Kitty Claw. But I have the handle. And it, like I said, it was 67 cents. 67 cents for this. And it is wood. It is a nice, nice. I like that. I like the color. And then you just because i did and now this is something that i don't think i have brought up a while back i had hauled some it was a case of seals that were plastic and the handle was plastic which i don't mind the handle but when like around christmas time when i was sending cards i tried using one of the plastic uh wax head stamp head that's like this this is a metal and it just was a mess. It was a mess. I do not recommend those plastic. I mean, if you can, if you have them and you use them and they work great, that is awesome. But they do not work for me. They just made a huge mess and ruined a couple cards so, or the envelope. So I was pretty bummed. So you just screw the, the handle into the wax topper, the wax seal. And there you go. I love it and so inexpensive so inexpensive 67 cents for the handle and i believe 50 78 cents for the seal that's a great deal right you know and as i like to say that you know i don't know because i forgot i forgot okay now staying in the rhythm of the seal for 89 cents i got 50 uh mixed the wax little dots that you use now i do also have wax um sticks that i like to use but that 
I hauled those like a long while back, like four months back. But I, I only have so many colors. And I do I did also haul a kit that only had the green wax in it. And I wanted to try some different colors before I go and purchase larger packs of the colors. So I just want this was just something I wanted to get for checking the colors out, you know. Okay, now this was a dollar eighteen and is now a dollar seventy nine. And it's just more washi tape, washi washi tape. And it's very pretty, very pretty. I love those colors. And again, you have multiple um, different styles to choose from. So from the dark colors, light colors, different, like I do believe that that has hearts on it, all different kinds of little pretty things. Okay, now I am excited about these two. These were $3.79 and now $4.28. And I am, oh, this curl. I am super excited. I am super excited about these. These are more uh, wooden stamps. But if you see, the tops are flowers. Look at that. Well, the tops aren't flowers. That's what the rubber stamps are. But that's what the stamps are. And again, they are wooden. Oh, come on. Please. Please. That hurt. Okay, well, they don't want to come out, y'all. They're like, huh, uh so let me press one from the bottom. Okay, there we go. So this one looks like, it really looks like a, a, an hibiscus. And then you have the rubber part and then this is wood it is very nice very nice i love it so yes yes oh now i'm losing them all you have here's another one and then the stamp so they are great and i will eventually be showing what these things can do I'm so excited to be doing this. I am not like, I'm not crafty, but I love to do crafts. I do. I, I'm, I'm willing to learn. Um, you know, I, I love watching people. They make that make jewelry and, you know, you have Laura from favorites with Laura. She is a jewelry maker and, uh, MC beaters, Caroline. She is a jewelry maker, and I love seeing all of the cool stuff that they haul for that. And I can't wait to see what they make either. But I, I don't think my hands would allow me to make jewelry. Um, I love jewelry, but I just don't think making jewelry is for me. And I love watching the process, though, and it's really cool. Okay, now this was... A dollar ninety eight and is now a dollar sixteen, or it could be on sale. You know, my prices when I say now is this might not be correct because, you know, every twenty four hours you get new um, you get new great deals, and so yes, if you are not familiar with Timu, Timu is an online marketplace that is not unlike Amazon, but not like amazon the prices at timu are you know half to three-fourths cheaper and that is no lie now this is a washi tape holder and you put let's see obviously you put your tape right here and it comes apart somehow. Let me see. And of course, there's no directions. It has a picture of like exactly what we're looking at. But you get the you put the tape on this on this right here. And then right here you have your cutter. So it's really basic. It's really really basic, you know. And I love this because the tape are so small that I could probably fit five or six on here, but it has these grooves 
on each side. And so these are stackable. So if you purchase more than one or two or three or however many I think you would like to stack, um, you can put them side by side. And, you know, if you're if you have that much washi tape. And so, yeah, I thought that was cool that they're stackable because I do plan on getting a couple more of these. Um, that washi tape is really, really small. And I don't want it just. OK, I did it. What you do is you just um you turn it see how it is got that shape so you push it in and then you turn it and that will lock it in there how smart is april today Woo! that made me feel good i did that i did that no 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 things too small don't give me such happiness when i figure it out so that's how you get the tape on there and I just thought this was a super cool deal. Super cool deal. And I do plan on buying more. Okay, just a few more items of, of um, crafting materials. Here, okay, this was 85 cents. And it is a red ink pad. And it was 85 cents. So I couldn't, you can't beat that. I mean, I... I always buying ink pads because I have a rubber stamp that has um, my business name on it that says, you know, it says April rain herbs and tinctures. And then below it, it says we only do natural and I love it. And I usually just stamp that all over around boxes, you know, with stickers and everything when I send off orders. So here is a red one. And like I said, it was 85 cents. And I'm excited about this one. This one was $1.48, which was on a sale. It's now $2.90. And it is a gradient from yellow to orange. And I love that. I love that. And as soon as the other colors, like the greens and the, the purples go on sale. Mm -hmm, yeah. So those are pretty. And I love how I'll be able to use my stamp and, you know, It'll, it'll just be a nice gradient color. How cool. Very cool. This stuff makes me feel, it makes me feel like a, like a kid a little bit, you know? I love it. I love it. Now, this was $1.75, and this is what the back looks like. So, it's like, I forget what this is called. Vintage Parchment. Writable Sticker package so it looks like vintage parchment which that is beautiful and here is your they are stickers and you can write on them so i guess the the what it is called kind of explains what it is but i thought those were really great and again you know seeing how um ashley from ashton's beauty had done hers I just thought that was awesome. And I know Gigi has shown a couple that she has done. And I'm telling you that the possibilities are just endless for what you can do and, and how you can arrange, you know, like when you're journaling, you're just putting down, you know, your thoughts, your emotions, your, that kind of thing, your daily you know, habits, whatever it is. But with this junk journaling, it, it's a whole world of magic. And that's how I feel. That's how I feel about it. So, okay, now these last two items that I have for the journaling, three, my bad. Now these are, this one was $1.98 and it is, and it is from the Soul, uh, Soul was the name of the, of the paper. I'm afraid if I take this out, I won't be able to get it back in there. It's the Soul Gothic Waltz. And this is just journal paper. And I thought that this was just beautiful. I thought it had a really great look. I love that. I do love, I love music paper. I love music paper and the newspaper, uh, old newspapers. I love old newspapers. And that is just gorgeous. Look at that. That is just gorgeous. Like, it makes me wonder what the song, if, you know, that was an actual song. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. 
he ain't playing around, is he? He is not playing around. That is gorgeous. Let's look at one more. Oh, there you go. There's my future home. How beautiful is that? How beautiful. Okay, I lied, right? One more. Oh, look at those. Now, <clears throat> excuse me. I am not for, I'm not a big rose aesthetic fan. I think they're beautiful. I think they smell beautiful, but I am not, look at that down there. The phases of the moon. I am not big on putting like roses on things, you know. I like real roses. Look at that. Oh my gosh, that is just gorgeous. Okay, so, you know, if you're interested in that and you want to see more, you got to go get you some. Mm -hmm. You got to get you some. Now let me get this back in its bag. Let's see, where are we? Oh my goodness. Looks like I might be going over an hour. You know, when I, I have been doing these hauls lately and I finish and I actually see how long they are, especially that one that was an hour and 40 minutes, it did not feel like an hour and 40 minutes. I'm telling you, it was, it, it just, I saw how long it was and I'm like, oh my gosh, my bad. But, you know, I do know that a lot of, a lot of you friends love the longer hauls and you know i'm happy to oblige but i do like to keep my hauls at around you know an hour that seems like a good a good amount of time okay so this one is mysterious attraction that's cool i love the mysterious you know i'm all about all that kind of stuff and these are more like potion bottles. You have a lot of potion style. Look at that. I love that. I love that. Now my daughter knows. Look, that is so cool. Cool and creepy. Look at that. Goes along with those castles, right? Oh, and you have two of each. I see. That is nice. So those are really, really cool. Oh, look at that. So yeah. And my daughter knows, like, she knows, um, she knows what I do and she, you know, she knows, she, she knows me. <laughs> so she'll feel that, that part of me when she's, when she's reading, when she has this journal. I also do plan on uh, doing one for my son, but that is going to be a whole different type of, of um, journal for him. Okay, now this is a Summer Tree 10-piece stickers. These are just stickers. I can't say just stickers because they are beautiful, glorious stickers. And I love them. Now what they are, are they're like, they're like archways. Look how pretty, look how pretty that is. I'm only going to take a couple out of here, but you have, um, that most of them look like cherry blossom trees, which I am totally cool with. Look at that. I just framed it on my face. Yay. Hi. And uh, yeah, so they just made me very happy. And again, with all of these types of uh, products and items that I'm showing you, there are different types. Look at how pretty that is. That is so pretty. Um, there are different types. So me, I believe I got this, it's the summer tree. So you do have a fall, uh, winter and spring. But what I chose was the summer and there are 10 pieces and this was $1.25. So $1.25 and they're really big. So awesome. Very awesome. Okay, now I'm going to, let me put this stuff back in this bag so I can show you some beauty items. I'm so excited. I am so excited i mean y'all just <laughs> you 
you know, I have been, I, I feel like for a while there, I was being a little, a little naggy, like towards uh, Gigi, you know, but we all have life. We have real life. We have family life. We have things in our life, things pop up. And so I'm, you know, I'm just grateful that I'm going to be able to do this really. So keep your eyes open. If you're into the junk journaling and you're looking forward to hanging out with Gigi and probably a quite a few of us, because I know there's a lot of us that are excited about this series. Okay. Let me set this back over here. I'm sorry about this. I just don't want to get all this stuff mixed up. You know what I mean? Okay, so another small bag. Nice little Timu, which I accidentally, when I open the bag, you all got to be careful opening your bags because you do something like this. I'm so grateful that I did not cut anything. So grateful. Okay, what do we got? Well, I know what I got in here. This... I just got lipstick all over that bag, but that bag smells funky. It smells very, very, uh, very um, chemically, chemically, very chemical like. Um, this first item is sold out. So I'm like, should I just throw it back there and be like, never mind? Um, I have a lotion that I like to use underneath my makeup. And I got it from Timu, and it is called, it was a brand name called Han Boli. H-A-N-B-O-L-I. Best stuff ever. It had, you know, SPF of 50. It's the smell. The smell. The smell made me happy. And it was creamy and wonderful. And I love it. And then it's been discontinued. And you know what the whole discontinued thing? I think what it is is because they are um, duping other products. So... Since that is such a, a big thing nowadays, not only with Timu, a lot of companies do this um, with all different kinds of products. But once the lawyers of the company that's being duped see it, then they send out cease and, cease and desist letters. So that's when they have to discontinue something. So then they just don't worry about being sued. They just stop and it's discontinued. And then sometimes the stuff will come back with like just a difference in a letter or something like that. You know, I do know that when I, right after I had purchased Lonnie's Griswold t-shirt, his Christmas t-shirt from the Griswold farm, it was discontinued. And so I just kind of noticed that a lot of things that do get discontinued, um, are dupe type products. I don't know if I'm right. It's just me trying to, I don't know, maybe guess. But this is called Nicor, Micor, and it is a new lotion. Now it's it's also SPF 50, and I'm so excited to smell it. I'm so excited to feel it because you know we like that creamy smooth velvety feeling Ooh, it's sparkling right when you first open it that's nice i like that and this is clarity isolation protection cream now this will this is what i will use underneath my makeup it'll be like before i even put on my primer does have a twist off cap just like oh and even at the top is like the han boli Oh my gosh. Okay. It smells wonderful. It feels wonderful. It feels creamy. It's thick. And it has got oh, that fresh scent that is not too overwhelming, but also not, you know, like medicinal or anything like that. It's very nice. This is very nice. And it is SPF 50 which I like that. So this is what it looks like. Nicor cream. And this is nice. So I think I need to purchase another bottle before it's gone. 
you know? I think I'm going to have to just start doing that because, you know, when I like something, I like it. Okay, so this product was $349 and is now $314. Oh, excuse me. It just fell right out of the bag. Now, this is what the box looks like. Lang Mani. Lang Mani. Look at that holographic. That's pretty. I like that. I like that. And this is Glow Bloom Liquid Highlighter. Glow Bloom Liquid Highlighter. Now, I am kind of excited about this. I'm having a hard time finding the blush colors that I want to use, the highlighter colors. Okay, come on. Come on now. And, you know, so I'm just trying a little bit of everything. And there are some blushes, liquid blushes, that they sell out and then they don't come back. And I think they were, they were dupes because they were kind of shaped in bottles like these. And I actually have a bottle. But this, it says beauty on the front and it's all holographic. Look at that. I like the packaging. The packaging is very pretty. I love that holographic though, that holographic look. Okay, let's check it out. The smell is not really a smell, but that is the type of applicator for the liquid blushes that I was looking for. Now let me stream it across my, get a little, a little look-see. I don't know if you can even see that oh there you go you can kind of see it i think it's very pretty there you go i like that that is nice yeah that is really nice very nice so yes this was called lang mani the brand and with the cool holographic but it's nice it's nice packaging and i like this i like this a lot so hopefully i'll like it on my face right okay okay now this i have to say i'm excited about this because first it was simply jessica marie she hauled this and was like, oh my gosh, this smells amazing. And just anytime I see someone that gets that happy about a scent, it makes me very happy. So, uh, that drives me nuts, right? So then it was, let's see, I'm trying to think of who it was next. If I get you out of order, I'm sorry, but I know that Laura from Favorites with Laura tried it and she loved it. I want to say that Aaron from Hey Everybody also tried it and loved it. I could be wrong, but you know, it all kind of smashes up together. And I, I watch so many hauls in that and it, I forget, you know, it's easy to forget. Um, but there have been a few and including, you know, my good friends that have tried it and it was $3.99. Now the individual bottle was sold out. So I, I had to purchase the male and the female version together, which is totally fine because Lonnie loves to smell good too. And this is, yes, it is the Venom Pheromone um, Roll-On Perfume. And so now I'm going to try it and I'm so excited. I've been waiting forever for this. <laughs> uh, I've been getting all my orders all out of whack. And uh, I placed an order last night and one piece of the order which is part of a really cool theme haul i'm going to be doing has to be shipped and it's not going to be here till march like the rest of the order is supposed to be here between the 10th and the 25th of this month but this one thing which i'm just going to tell you i'm going to have to tell you is a plushie it's a plushie why does the plushie need to be shipped by sea 
It's being shipped by sea. I don't understand, but I'm very bummed about it because it was a very big part of this themed haul. Just, you know, and so I'm like, what is going on, Timu? Okay. Are you all ready? I, I mean, I'm ready. So very cool bottle, pink, and it is a roller. Mm, oh, yummy, yummy. Let's see. Let's see how it smells on me. Oh, it don't smell. I'm just kidding. It smells wonderful. Oh, my gosh. I love this. Thank you, Jessica. Thank you, Erin. Thank you, Laura. Thank you to everybody that hauled this. <laughs> this and it smells so good on me. I was worried about that. I don't know why I was worried about that, but like, you know, because this, these scents are supposed to mix with your own, you know, chemicals, hormones, your own pheromone scents. And, you know, if it doesn't smell good, then it's like, ooh, you know, but huh. oh my gosh, y'all. I do know this is back. This is back in its singular uh, packaging. So if you like perfume, y'all got y'all got to get some of this. Y'all got to get some of this because this is yummy. This is yummy. I love it. I'm so happy. I can't even express how happy I am. I am so, yeah, my, I'm smiling so hard. My eyes are closing because of my chubby cheeks. <laughs> oh, that's a thing when there's a, a good scent. I just want to keep smelling it. Ooh, Lonnie will be home soon. Hey, babe, what's up? What's up, babe? <laughs> I'm so bad about that, too. Every time that I have a good scent or something smells good, I just bother the heck out of him. And smell this. Smell this. You got to smell this. And he's like, babe, I've smelt it. You know, I know what apples smell like. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. I don't even know. Okay. Let's smell the dudes. Like, I won't be able to tell on him until later. And then in my next video, I will let you know, but I'm sure it's going to be yummy because Lonnie has got, Lonnie has got like a good natural scent. I don't know. I don't know, but it's like, um, I don't know, but it is a really good natural scent. Like even after working and everything, I'll smell up in here and he'll be like, babe, I need to take a shower. And I'm like, but it smells so good. He's like, you're crazy. I'm not though. It does smell good. And I think all you ladies out there know what I'm talking about. Hmm. See, it's weird because it, like the other one does not smell in the bottle as it smells on me. And that smells delicious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this, this smells good. I'm smelling like Speaking of like a fruity kind of, I don't know, but I will let y'all know how good it smells on Lonnie. I mean, hopefully it smells good. It should. Usually, Lonnie usually goes for like um, more of the woodsy, musky, um, sandalwood type kind, um, oak, moss, those kinds of scents. And they just mesh with him so well. It's like, Yum. I am such a huge scent person. I I love scents. <clears throat> Excuse me. Like scents do not let me hydrate for a minute, please. I don't have allergies to scents. I do know that there are a lot of people out there that do have allergies to perfumes. But then again, there are a lot of perfumes out there and colognes like um axe i'm sorry i cannot handle axe i cannot handle axe um back in the day we used to have a young friend and he would just 
use half a can, you know, and it, 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 I can't handle that stuff. That stuff I cannot handle. It's like in the powder sprays that spray like powder and the scent. I don't like those either because I feel like I can, I'm feeling them in the back of my throat and they're choking me. I don't know. It's, it's weird. I don't know, but I love scents. I love scents. Okay. Just a few more items. I was so excited about that. You know, I was so excited. It's all I could think about with um doing this haul okay now this this was a dollar four and as you all may know for those of you that hang out with me often i do like the crazy colors of makeup makeup lipstick and there is a certain brand and i'm not sure I don't even know. I'm having a problem with this. It's called Tiasen. Tiasen. And it is, I have purchased several different colors from them, um, including white, yellow. Uh, it's white and yellow. There's a few other colors. But this is for, I got this because I needed some black lipstick anyways. So here we have, and it is black, beautiful black. But I needed this for a specific themed haul. And uh, I love this stuff. It is a little bit drying. So I will try to, I try to put some kind of lip moisturizer underneath. And then I use this and then I try to put some kind of moisturizer on top. I learned my lesson a ways back when I first got the white lipstick, I put it on without any kind of moisturizer. Oh my gosh. By the end of that video, my mouth felt like it felt like it hadn't had, you know, my lips felt like they hadn't had water in a hundred years, you know, and they were cracked looking and it was really, <laughs> it was really a mess, but, um, I've learned my lesson and, you know, it, it's cool. I like this company because I like, they do have more colors that I would like to get like uh, green and blue and uh, a few other colors. So I'm pretty excited. I love it. Y'all know I love it. Okay. Now this is, this is the, uh, this was 209 and is now 298. Now for these um, beauty products, I did, uh, I priced these right before making a video. So these are correct on the prices for the beauty, the beauty items. I've been thinking about wanting to do a beauty haul where I also will, it would be like a get ready with me. Now, as I've said before, I had, I've had some friends ask for me to do a get ready with me or a tutorial I do not gracefully put on makeup. It's not graceful and pretty like, you know, all of the other women I've seen that will do a get ready with me. And it's, it just, it's so graceful looking. I don't look like that. Plus I do have, I am pretty insecure about my skin right now. I mean, there are videos out there, you know, of me with no makeup on and you know, it's fine. I'm not vain like that, but it just, it's my own insecurity. And, uh, I have really dark circles because I have a really bad sleep cycle right now. Um, you know, and like I said, you know, so I am wearing like full coverage foundation. I'm wearing concealer, um, contour, all that kind of stuff. So I'm really grateful and thankful that, you know, for those of you that say such kind things to me, but I do have a lot of makeup on. Okay. This is the, it's called May box velvet liquid blush in ready cherry ready ready cherry so i've been trying to get one of these for a while now and actually it's a different brand but i don't think that they i think it's a dupe for a uh, rare beauty and which i've never used that product but i haven't seen them back in stock so i'm not sure if they're even going to come back in stock so I got this one to try. <clears throat> now, see, since I do wear so many, excuse me, I'm sorry. I've got some kind of something in the back of my 
throat that's making me itch and itch. Um, because I do like to use so many different colors, I like to change up my blushes also. So let's see. Okay. 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 That's a nice color. Okay. Nice and blendable. That's something I'm having problems with this other. Nice and blendable. This other blush that I had purchased from Timu. So that's nice. I like that. I think I'm going to like this a lot. I think I'm going to like it a lot. And it is called Maybox. I do like the container. I love that it's very creamy. Um, and I love the, the applicator. I love that applicator. So yeah, that's a really pretty color. I think it's going to be nice. I think it's going to be nice. And I got this in the nick of time. I honestly think that I might have got the last one at that time because then it was sold out. So um, it did get, it was sold out before I waited for it and it came back and I was able to catch it before it was sold out again. Okay. I only have a couple more items. And if you're still here, thank you for still being here and hanging out with me. I, I'm, I'm grateful. That's awesome. This was a dollar thirty four and is now a dollar four. A dollar four. At the prices, man. I'm telling you, the prices on their beauty products are amazing. But as I was saying, yeah, I would really, really like to um do that. Do a get ready with me. I've been really nervous about it. Kind of like the same about being nervous about doing lives. Because I'm still, you know, I'm still wanting to do that. Because that, to me, makes me feel that we are doing more of a back and forth. Um, this is July Star Soft Matte Lip. Now, I have been looking for red lipsticks. And all the, all the lipsticks that I buy that look red. <coughs> boo. That's enough that look red they end up being like an orangey color just one second okay so Bodhi heard something and he started freaking out so i had to calm him down get a little rough with them you know i'm just kidding but not really so back to the uh red july star soft matte lip I, this is supposed to be the red. This is supposed to be the one. This is supposed to be the one. Now, I'm obviously not going to put it on my lips. I mean, I kind of know because it'll, it'll. Whoa. This might be the one. Look at that. Oh, wow. See, the, the reds that I have been purchasing have just been had too much orange in it and i wanted that perfect red i mean i think most y'all women can understand what i'm talking about and i think i might have found one beautiful right on and i can't wait so you know that red lip it's got to be that perfect perfect hue okay and i have another which it looks like another lip lip color and it was a dollar 39 and is now a dollar 84 and this one says oh this is another one of dragon dragon something i love that holographic look i do and of course the skull you know Gotta love the skull. It's gotta make it edgy. Um, oh, I think this is another red lip. Oh no. <laughs> this is sometimes I do have this look that I used to do back in the eighties that I thought was really funny and I liked it too, but it is, the color is called Barbie. Oh, I love it. I love it. 
and I can actually pull these colors off. I, I, it's kind of a trip, but really nice, really nice. So that'll be fun. I love this company too. They do have a lot of, um, crazy colors. If you want to say that a lot of great colors. Okay. Now this last item, last item at, a, at an hour and 19, this is actually for Lonnie. Now this is called multiple Eff efficacy, moisturize, skin smoothing, firming from a, a company, a brand called Lan, Lane May or Lana May. Now this is, well, it's moisturized, skin smoothing, firming, but this is for men. And this, oh, just one second. Okay, sorry about that. Lonnie got home and Bodhi freaked out and uh, sirens were going on outside. So down to the last item, as I was saying, it was $3.98 and it is multiple efficacy from Lane May or Lana May, but it is moisturized, skin smoothing and firming serum for my Lani. And I'm actually very happy to, to be getting some skin products for Lani. This is what the bottle looks like. It is face cream men's formula. So, because you know, you know, the men, they got to have, you know, keep their skin moisturized also. And uh, I'm happy to be seeing, you know, products that do this. So, it is a nice size, also. Nice size, nice packaging. I like that. Nice and chromed out. I am going to shake a, shake a, shake a. Does have the nice little. Give it a few pumps so you can nice and creamy. Look how it just has its uh, peak right there. Nice and firm. So nice and thick too. Ooh, that feels good. Oh yeah. He's going to like this. He's going to like this smell. Very nice. Very nice. A very clean, not fruity or anything like that. It's just a very clean scent. Nice and creamy. Very creamy. It's got a nice, nice consistency. So I, I think he's going to like this. I think he's going to like using this to moisturize his face. So <clears throat> that will do it for this haul. Um, if you're still here hanging out with me, thank you. Thank you so much for hanging out. Um, I hope you enjoyed all of the cool journaling things that, that I'm going to, you know, that I showed that I'm going to be using soon and um, the beauty products. If you have any questions or please tips and tricks or any kind of experiences you have with any of the products that I have hauled today, please let me know. Let me know. And even if you don't want to leave a comment, send, shoot me an email. Let me know. You know what I mean? I mean, I do appreciate the comments, of course, and I love all of your comments. Um, if you're new here, hello, welcome. I am happy that you are here with us, and I hope that you consider subscribing giving me a thumbs up and uh continue to join us here for all this menopausal madness stuff right so um i hope you all have an amazing weekend um um how many times can i say um or like that line from the movie this is not a time for um um <laughs> i'm just kidding um thank you <laughs> i don't even know it just like comes out without me even thinking about it so i would like to thank you all and let you all know how much 
I love every single one of you and that I'm so grateful that you are here with us. And uh, please, please remember to be kind humans.